guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my everyday makeup products and these are just basically all the products that I've been using every day this summer. And the reason I didn't title it an everyday um, summer makeup product is because I've been using most of these products like, throughout my makeup routine if you guys are wondering what changed. And I've been trying out lots of new products throughout the summer and this is just lots of makeup products I've added to my new makeup products. So without further ado, let's get started in the video. So the very first thing I use is my Maybelline Master Primer, and this primer is literally a goddess. I love it so, so much. It's a beautiful, it's amazing. I think it could be a straight up a dupe for the Smashbox Primer, as I've said in previous videos. Um, it helps my makeup last all day long, like completely out in the sun and just sweating through everything. Like I go through an amuse I go to an amusement park that's by my house, and it's so hot there, and I sweat so much. And this literally keeps my makeup on all day, so I would definitely recommend this primer. And this is just the primer I use. The next product I use is in every single everyday makeup product video is my Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade, and I just have it still in the box. It's not new, don't get fooled. It's actually pretty old. I've had it for a good time, a long amount. I've had it for over like six months, and this stuff works amazing. I definitely love that. I would definitely, definitely recommend this product. It's a holy grail. It makes your eyebrows look beautiful, and I love this eyebrow product. I probably wouldn't switch to any other eyebrow product. I actually tried the Benefit Cabral one, and I feel like it's just the exact same thing as Anastasia, but Anastasia is cheaper and it works amazing. So, yeah, and I just have the color chocolate, and it's on my eyebrows if you guys are wondering what it looks like. But I just use this every day, my everyday makeup look. The next thing I use, the next thing I do is eyeshadow. I've been wearing eyeshadow a lot in summer, but what a coincidence! I'm not wearing any eyeshadow today in this video just because I felt like going natural, but um, yeah, I usually use my Morphe 35O palette, and this is also still in the box, but I just use my Morphe 35O palette on a daily basis when I feel like doing my eyeshadow. It's pretty much every single day in the summer. This is like the first day I didn't wear eyeshadow this summer when I do my makeup. But I love this palette. I've been using it ever since I bought it. I got it like at the beginning of June, like literally June 1st. And I love it, I love it, I love it. And this is a beautiful palette for summer. Like the colors on the side are beautiful for summer and fall. So I use my Morphe 35 Oil palette, but I've been using every day. The next thing I use is for foundation, I use my Ulta Demi Matte Foundation in the color Cool Town, and I love this foundation. Definitely recommend this to you guys. Um, it's not really like a drugstore product. It's at Ulta and it's their brand. And I just wanted to try it out just to go. Um, it's cheaper than like a high end one, like Too Faced or something. But this foundation works amazing. I love it. It gives me a pretty glowy look and tan, and I love it. It works. It's super smooth, like this as it is. It blends in so nice. It smells really great too. So this is just the foundation I use every day. And then to highlight my face, oh wait, before we do that, I've been using this NYX Born to Glow Liquid Illuminator in the color Pure Gold, and I use, this is one of the new products I've been starting out using this summer. Um, I just mix it with my foundation, and it gives me the most beautiful, glowy, dewy, bronze look ever, and I really love this, so this is what I use with my foundation. Sometimes I'll use it without my foundation, but I've been mainly mixing it in with my foundation, and then just using a highlighter. So yeah. And then the next thing I do to highlight under my eyes and like my forehead and my chin and all that good stuff, I just use the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Dark Circles Concealer. And I love, love, love this concealer. It's an amazing drugstore concealer. I'm definitely going to be buying it again. I'm almost out of it, which I'm pretty sad about. But um, it's just this, so what it looks like. And it's in the color Neutralizer, and I really, really love this concealer. It works great, and I would definitely recommend this. It stays on all day. It covers everything super great. I mean, I don't really have dark circles, but a highlight's really pretty. If you guys could see under my eyes. But, yeah. I think a highlight's really pretty, and it works really great. So, the next thing I use to, like, kind of contour, or, like, just a warm-up, like, in between my cheekbones and on the temples of my forehead, I use my Ulta color correcting palette, and I've used up all the other colors, I'm just finishing the dark color. I just use the darkest color right there, if you guys can see, it's almost all gone, but I just use that to like contour, a small contour, not like an extreme contour. And then the next thing I use it 
to bake my face after I've done the highlighting and the contour is my Airspun Loose Face Powder, if you guys can see. This is just what it looks like. And you guys probably have seen in my other videos, I love this product. It works amazing. It's literally another goddess. It works great. I love it to bake my face. It keeps my makeup on all day. My highlight, if you guys can see. I literally got back from an amusement park today. I've been there since 12 and it's now 6. And my makeup looks amazing with it. And then, the next thing I use for mascara is the Physicians Formula Organic Wear. And this is literally new. When I first got it, I wasn't so sure about it. But now I love it. I'm obsessed with it. And the packaging is super duper cute. It's like this swirly thing. And it's yellow and pink. And it's super pretty. So I've just been using this mascara every day. And then the next to almost last thing is... I use my Ulta Sculpting Palette, so after, when my face is baking, I usually bronze up my face um, with this bronzer right here, and it works amazing, it gives me a beautiful, beautiful, glowy, bronzed look, and then for highlight, if you guys could see my highlight, I hope you guys can, I could see it amazing in person, but um, I just use this Ulta highlighter right here. And it's amazingly beautiful. I love it. I'm super duper obsessed with it. I've been using it every single day. And then I also use the blush just to give my cheeks like some sort of color because I've never been like a big blush person, but I don't know. I've just been adding it to the apples of my cheeks and it looks really pretty. So yeah, those is just, I mean, that is what's in the Sculpting Palette by Ulta. And I use this every single day. And then the last thing is I usually always wear a lipstick color every single day because I feel naked if I'm not wearing a lipstick color. But I'm just going to show you guys an example of the lip color I'm wearing today. And it's super duper pretty. It's called the Buxom and the color is Centerfold. And this is just what it looks like. It's a mini version of it. Let's see. It's really cute. I like the packaging. It's pretty. And that's like this new. It's matte also. But it's nude and it's super pretty. I've been liking this a lot this summer. I always wear different lipstick every day. This is just the color I happen to be wearing today. And I really like it. It's matte, but also how it looks like I'm going to have like the shimmering eyeshadow over it. But it looks super pretty and I really like this. So I always wear a lip color every day. And this is just the color I'm wearing today. So that's just all my makeup products I've been using every single day. These are all my everyday makeup products. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, a subscribe, and be sure to comment down below what you guys would like to see because I need video suggestions. And I'm super sorry, little disclaimer that I didn't say in the beginning. I know I've been saying I've been film I the I'm filming every single day of the week. I didn't miss Monday. And I believe I missed like two days last week. I just got really busy, so I'm definitely gonna be getting back into filming videos for you guys every day. But I hope you guys like this video and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!